The vote of no confidence is a symbolic one, but the FOP president hopes the mayor as well as the police superintendent start paying attention to what they're saying. There is no love lost between Mayor Lori Lightfoot and FOP President John Catanzara. The two have been publicly critical of each other since they were both elected. Catanzara has also butted heads with Police Superintendent David Brown. But the FOP's vote of no confidence last night for both the mayor, Brown, and his second-in-command, Eric Carter, came, we're told, from about 200 rank-and-file members. Today, the membership spoke loud and clear. Catanzaro says the city's largest police union took the no-confidence votes for two reasons. One, because the department canceled the St. Jude parade for a second year in a row, citing the pandemic as the reason. It's a lack of respect for the Gold Star families and the cancellation of the St. Jude parade. Uh, not only the Gold Star families, but our members who look forward to remembering the fallen uh, every year. The FOP decided, however, to put on its own ceremony without the department's help. The second part of the no confidence vote was the working conditions for our officers for the better part of a year now and a lack of consideration for family life, uh, social life. Working without a contract for more than three years, the FOP president says the city and department regularly cancel days off and make officers work 12-hour shifts as a just-in-case something may happen, not for an actual emergency. Catanzaro says it is upending members' lives and eroding what little morale is left in the department. It's become a recurring theme for the last several years that every holiday is going to be canceled because they are trying to keep the numbers down. The numbers still come no matter what. <laughs> I mean, we had record overtime last year, but yet in July we had record numbers. In one day we had 21 homicides. So what did that overtime accomplished nothing. Yesterday's vote came as word was coming out of City Hall. Mayor Lightfoot's long anticipated civilian police oversight plan was ready. Earlier this week, the City Council's Black and Hispanic caucuses presented a plan that Lightfoot rejected. So far, we haven't gotten any word on a timeline on when we may learn some details of the mayor's plan. We are at FOP headquarters in the West Loop. I'm Eric Runk, WGN News.